Student safety. It is something so many of us parents are thinking about as we get our kids prepared to return to the classroom. A Guilford County mom wants to make sure there's enough security at her child's school, and she started a petition to get other parents on board. Fox's Caroline Boyer joins us tonight. So, Caroline, how much support does she have? Neil, this change.org petition Alexis Thompson started after the Uvalde shooting has almost 1,500 signatures in support of putting school resource officers in Guilford County Elementary Schools. Right now, they're only in middle and high schools, but this mom is hoping her petition can change that. I'm terrified. The last few days of school, um, I hesitated to send my kids. There were days I did not send them. I was sick to my stomach. That feeling hasn't gone away for Alexis Thompson. She's preparing to send her two children to second and third grade at Southern Elementary with the tragedy in Uvalde, Texas, still in the back of her mind. They go to school every day. I'm not there with them. I can't protect them. She wants a school resource officer to do that job at elementary schools across the county. I understand that an SRO officer may or may not be able to stop a situation, but it's a beginning security point. Guilford County Schools is working to amp up security with the latest school bond voters passed. In June, the district safety and security director told Fox 8 that includes creating vestibules in elementary schools to create a two layer entry. The district also plans to put touchless security scanners inside the county's 19 high schools. If that goes well, they'll add them to middle schools but not elementary. In elementary school, it's almost always from outside of the school, so it's more important to make sure that no one comes into the school. And then at your middle and high, it tends to be someone from within the school who, who would uh, perpetrate the crime. So we've got to focus at the people going into the school. So it's a little bit different. Alexis thinks that's a step in the right direction, but she won't settle for just vestibules. I think it's a good idea. Anything towards a more safe schools is, is a good idea to me, but it really depends on the layout of those schools. I reached out to Guilford County Schools to get a comment on this petition and an update on the progress made this summer to increase security measures. I was told no one would be available to speak with me until Monday. Katie Neal.